La porte. This is a door. Can I touch it? Barbara lost her sight 20 years ago because of a degenerative disease. But these glasses are helping her recover some of it. It might be pretentious, but I feel like the first man who walked on the moon. She's involved in a clinical trial of a retinal implant system being developed by French company Pixium Vision. So this is on the surface of the ocular globe, and then we have this flat wire. At the very end of this, you have the 150 electrodes lying on the surface of the retina. A mini camera built into the glasses transmits the signal to an implant behind the retina, and that allows the eye to see in two dimensions for now with shapes and basic shades. This first generation of implants costs 100,000 euros. But first, it needs approval. Something its US competitor, Second Sight, already has. But that doesn't worry Pixium. We have developed a completely different camera system, which is an event-based camera, which we call this neuromorphic camera, because it really works like the retina. And also the number of electrodes, where they have 60, we are going to have 150. Then you will have a better resolution. Pixium hopes to begin clinical trials for its next generation device by 2016. Called Prima, the implants will have 2,000 electrodes. And here we believe that the patient would be able to recognize faces and maybe to read again. The person in black is on the left. And for patients like Barbara, the future can only get brighter. Caroline Cannon, Bloomberg, Paris.